Hello all, I uh, was encouraged by my wife to see if I could look directly at you. I didn't realize the camera was on this side of the iPad, so I'm going to look at the camera. Uh, let me give you a quick discussion about the um, uh, Gospels, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. Um, the first three, Matthew, Mark, and Luke, were are considered the synoptic Gospels, whereas John is a little more mystical, a little bit different. Um, it's interesting in the Gospels, if you take a look at them, especially the resurrection stories, uh, they're all different. Uh, check it out sometime. There's differences in the uh, who was in the empty tomb, who wasn't in the empty tomb, uh, what disciples went to the tomb, uh, women that went to the tomb without disciples. So it's a very different thing. The, also, the other thing that's very fascinating about the different gospel accounts are the feelings that people were having uh, as they um, uh, discovered uh, that Jesus uh, was no longer there. So that's an interesting thing about the Gospels. Um, they were written at different times, as I mentioned before. Uh, the first Gospel written that uh, we believe was Mark, and uh, Mark then was used by later authors, uh, Luke and um, uh, Matthew and then John, um, kind of building on each other. Uh, the interesting thing, too, is in Matthew and um, Luke, we have Jesus' uh, birth stories. Uh, which were not found in um, John and, uh, and Mark. So uh, it's interesting to see the differences. I think it's an important uh, thing to understand. And so the next video we're going to discuss a few things that I find enjoyable in the uh, uh, book of Matthew. So we'll finally get to the books. All right, take care.